If you run a home-based bakery business or small bakery shop owner and you're struggling with social media, this video is for you. Hi everyone, this is Maureen Kamari, author of How to Start Up a Small Baking Business, founder of Amari Baking Center. In this channel, we share cake decoration tutorials, baking recipes, and baking for business advice. If this is something you're interested in, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to this channel. So in this video, I'll be sharing three tips that'll help you with your social media marketing, especially if you're a baker. So the first tip I wanna share with you is be consistent. If you choose to start marketing your business on social media, whether it's on Instagram or Facebook, you need to make sure you're consistent. I talk to a lot of bakers who tend to post every once in a while. They're very erratic about posting and then they wonder why their channels or their accounts aren't growing and that's because you're not consistent. Whatever social media you choose to be on or to promote your brand on, you need to be completely consistent. This means maybe posting Monday to Saturday at specific times every week, every month, every year. Before I share the second tip, I just wanna share with you guys that we have a free social media marketing training that's happening on Facebook. This is a free training that's gonna go on all the way to April 15th. So if you're interested in getting some tips on how to market your business, especially your bakery business online, make sure to check the description box on how to join the group. The second tip is you need to come up with a social media strategy. You need to discover or sit down and decide which social media sites are, are you gonna be using. If you're new at this, you can choose maybe two or three, or if you've been doing it for a while, you can maybe just uh, plan on getting consistent on the two or three social medias that you're actually on. You need to sit down, discover which channels you're gonna be posting on, and then agree or like decide on when you're going to be posting and what you're going to be posting. You can't just randomly wake up every day and just uh, post by on the fly. So you need to sit down and decide, am I going to be sharing testimonials? Am I going to be sharing product videos or behind the scenes? Just sit down, come up with a plan when you're going to post, how you're going to post it and the type of content you're going to be sharing. This is going to help you be more consistent over time. The third tip is to make sure you're checking your insights. So whether you're on Facebook or you're on Instagram, you'll note that if you have a business account, you have a section that talks about insights or analytics. Most people post maybe daily, maybe you're posting every week or every month, but you're not getting good engagement or you're not getting people buying from you. And sometimes you need to check your insights so you can figure out what is working for you and what is not working for you. So just posting and leaving the channel doesn't help you. You need to figure out what's happening with your channel and the only way to know that is by actually checking your insights and your insights tell you a lot of stuff they tell you what content is doing better than the other when your audience is online what what your actual audience is reacting to whether it's videos or photos so you need to make sure you're checking your insights to make sure you get a clear picture of what's happening if you need to then you're able to actually adjust and experiment to see how it works so most people post on social media but they don't check their insights make sure you're checking those insights so you can analyze the work that you're doing or the marketing that you're actually doing. So to recap, three tips for social media marketing for bakers. First, be consistent when it comes to posting. Secondly, come up with a social media strategy. And third, make sure you're checking your insights at least every seven days to know what's happening with your account. So if you want to join that free training I talked about, we're having a social media marketing training that's free for bakers all the way to April 15th. Make sure you check our description box to see the link on how to join that uh, and maybe you can learn a few things or two.